on Saturday night, we saw another two celebrities unveiled on The Masked Singer. Skin from Skunk and Easy was revealed as a duck. And the second <laughs> was my next guest. Kelly was right. And Jake Shears joins me now live from New York. It is so good to see you. And a unicorn was perfect. Perfect for you. Oh, my God. I had so much fun. I had the best time. I was really... Uh... I was devastated when I got unmasked. <laughs> I know. I was I truly... Yeah, uh, I know. I was truly, truly upset. <laughs> I don't blame you. Listen, but, though, I, how hard still. was it? You know, in that, in that suit and trying to move around and trying to perform, because you're such a fantastic performer, it must have been really, really difficult to move around in that thing. It was borderline impossible. <laughs> I mean, you, you're breathing heavy in that thing and... Uh, it was really tough. If I would have known I was going to be doing this uh, six months ago, I would have been in boot camp. You know, yeah. I would have been really training for it. It was really, really hard. It, it did look scary and you did so, so well. <laughs> but how tough was it to keep that a secret? I mean, you had to keep it a secret from everybody, including your own mum. Including my mother, who, you know, she gets Google alerts on me and, and, and you know, my, my name was being batted around with this show. And a couple weeks ago, my, my mom calls me. And, you know, if you do know me or, you know, if, if I am your son and you hear me <laughs> singing, she, she, my mom calls <laughs> me and she's like, she's like, you know, nice, nice unicorn. And I was like, I had, I had to be like, I have no idea what you're talking about. Yes. I don't know what the show is. <laughs> so, Jake, <laughs> tell me, <laughs> tell, have you got any idea at all who the others that are left in? Do you have any inkling? as to who they might be, or do you I just I have some know? guesses. Okay. I've got some guesses. I think, I think, I think Tony Hadley might be the hedgehog. Tony Hadley might be the hedgehog? And that's just because, mm. yeah, from Spandau Ballet. Yeah, yeah, I, because yeah, yeah. I was riding home in a car one night after just getting to hear him sing a little bit, and I swear to God, I was like, oh my God. That I think Tony Hadley's a hedgehog, and I don't know if his name's really being batted around that much, but... No, that's um, an that's, interesting I think, one. I think Queen Bee could be maybe Leona Lewis, maybe. Ah. I think Queen Bee's going to win. Mm. I think Queen Bee's going to win. She's really, really fantastic, yeah. and I just have a feeling that she might end up being the winner. But it's been so crazy because I've had no idea who else is on this show with me until, <laughs> until people are getting unmasked. So it's a trip just to... Uh, think that we, you know, we're all kind of out on stage together and don't even know who the other people are. There's um, no other show like I've it. I've never experienced yeah. anything like it in my life. No, nobody it has. Was so, <laughs> nobody so has. weird. And I loved every minute of it. Oh, I just, so it was so much fun. And there's so much going on. Now, look, you've got a new single out, which is fantastic. This is Meltdown. We have got a sneaky preview. You can, you can download it, but have, have a wee look it's at it. We're announcing it right now. I'm, I know, I'm it's amazing. It let's let's weeks. have a look. Yeah. I'm just on my phone now uh, downloading that. That is fabulous. That's one of those songs when you put that on, everybody's just going to get up and dance. And it's a celebration. It's terrific. I've been making a bunch of disco music. I've been making a bunch of dance songs, so I'm super, super excited to put something new out now. Looking forward to that. It's going to, it's out on Friday, but obviously, like I said, you can, you can get it, you can get it before then. You're also, hopefully, fingers crossed, going to be working with Elton John on a, on a musical, maybe? Uh, what, what's the latest on that? Yeah, no, we've been, we've been working, we're, we're deep into a amazing musical that I'm so, so excited about. Um, about televangelists, and it's going to be very special. So yeah, we've been we've been working. I mean, he's just one of my longtime collabor I mean, collaborators. We've been we've written songs together for a long time and performed together, and he's one of my dear dear friends. So it's uh, it's an honor to get to work on a on a large piece like this with him. But it's been amazing. I'm really really excited about it. Can't wait to see that. That's going to be good. And look, Jake, I know everybody asks you this, but you know I'm a huge fan of Scissor Sisters. And you've never kind of said that you're not working together again. I mean, is it going to happen? Do you think it's inevitable that you guys will all get together again and make some more music and do some tours? What do you think? Absolutely. Yay! I think so. <laughs> I hope so. Yeah, someday. Someday, you know, when, when everybody's uh, ready for it, I would love to. I would love to get back on stage with Scissor Sisters. Well, we would love it too, because the songs are blinking joyful. In the meantime, though, we've got, we've got your single out, which is absolutely terrific, and we very much enjoyed you in The Masked Singer. Uh, you don't get to keep the outfit, though, do you? Thank you. you? 
I don't, but you know, when I took that mask off for the last time, I was completely fine with never having to put it on again. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bet. So I good to talk to you. I remember taking it like, anyone could have this. Yes, there you um, are. It is for you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me today. Oh, lovely to talk to you as always. Next time you're over, come in and see us. It's just great to see you. It really is. Um, and as we said, Meltdown Same. is out on Friday. The Mass Singer continues on Saturday. I think it's 7 o'clock this Saturday on ITV.